really noisy. They may quiet down a little later, but uh, they're usually pretty noisy. Uh, we're not hurting them. We take a little blood sample, a little prick there. It doesn't really hurt them, and but they're just sort of excited, and not used to people and whatever. But uh, we didn't have any problem up there. I guess the first thing one of them got me in the hand. Which, <laughs> I'm on my jacket on, but I didn't have the glove on yet, so it's not a big deal. But uh, both both parents were there. We were able to confirm both identities again. So the same same birds we've had in the past, uh, Kenny for his 15th year, and then uh, Kathy Q for her eighth year. So we're gonna pop one out and put uh, leg bands on them. These are colored leg bands and these are Fish and Wildlife Service bands which has unique numbers. And these bands you can see from a distance with the binoculars or spotting scope. There's a size for males and size for females. We think we have three females and a male here. And then we'll take a little blood sample and then uh, we'll uh, get this going here. So grab one. Grab one. <laughs> Go ahead, Amy. Grab one. Oh, 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 oh. Girl. These guys are a little older than kind of previous years. I mean, they're a little bit more feathered and whatnot. Yeah. And this is, uh, yeah. Look at the mama going. The females have larger legs. You see? So we'll get the female bands here. Oh, 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 they don't like that. No, they don't. Oh, they And as part of the contest, you may recognize this name. 
the judges decided on Sully, which was named for the airline pilot that landed the in the air. Cool. I was going to send that name in, and I thought, oh, that guy, that was what I was going to say. It's by Greg Bodley of Indianapolis. Cool.